Caitlin, do you guys just want me to do stuff? <laughs> so I live in St. Paul, Minnesota. About 10 minutes from my house is Circus Juventus, which is the largest youth circus in North America. I started going to see shows uh, there with my mom and my sister, like when I was pretty young. There was like this one show, it was called Swash that we went and saw and that one I was immediately like yes I want to do this for my first show I got stage fright and didn't want to go on and then like I liked it once I actually did it But like that's so funny to think about now <laughs> I know I'm like it's the most stressful process ever and then it's like okay <laughs> It was October 4th. I know the exact date because it was the day before my birthday and the day that I had tickets to go see Hamilton as part of like the freshman class. And so we'd been talking ahead of time about like meeting at Norris where like everyone was supposed to line up for the buses and trying to like sit together so that we'd also get tickets together because um, they gave out the, the tickets on the buses. But we weren't hearing from Maddie. It was probably like 30 minutes before I had to get up and start getting ready for class. I woke up to her having a seizure. I had to catch her from falling off of the bed. So luckily though, I was able to find people that um, helped me. Um, they called the Northwestern Health Services for me. And then finally we got like a response back from her that was pretty brief and was just like, yeah, um, so I had a seizure. Um, and I'm at the hospital now. Every time I have one, it's terrifying. I go like completely unconscious and like just like start seizing and stuff. As someone who's epileptic, I technically shouldn't be doing circus. So if I was like to be in the air when that happened, obviously that would be really bad. I, I hate that it's hindering her own college experience. I think the condition is just something that Maddie knows um, and has successfully been powering through, working through, not letting it get to her, not letting it really impact her life. You know, Maddie is just such a performer. Like when, when I see Maddie perform, it's like definitely something where I see her and I'm like, yeah, she's doing what she's meant to do. And I think circus really allows all the, her best performative qualities to shine through. One of the things that you have to get used to that kind of sucks is being nauseous all the time from the spinning. And like, I'm someone who does not like spinny rides or anything. So being nauseous, I guess is a, a perk of the job. What makes you like this if you don't like spinning rides? Um, the adrenaline and everything else. Like, I don't like the spinning, but I love performing and stuff. So as long as I can do that, I'll tolerate the spinning. If I was constantly thinking about the fact that I could have like a seizure at any point, like I wouldn't be doing circus. Um, and that's something I love. So epilepsy is like frustrating because I don't have any control over my body. But with circus, I have complete control over my body. It's like a big fuck you. Cause it's like, okay, yeah, I have that, but I'm still like, I can still control my body and like, do like amazing things with it. Yeah.